The arrest of an alleged spy in Ukraine risks straining UK-Russia relations even further. Stanislav Yezhov worked as an interpreter for Ukraine's Prime Minister Volodymyr Groysman and sat in on meetings with international leaders, including with Britain's Prime Minister. Now he's accused by Ukraine of spying for Moscow. This official had access to rather specific inside government information. He was well respected and at the same time worked responsibly, accurately and creatively for the Russian intelligence services. Yezhov, seen here at Groysman's side on a visit to London in July to meet with Prime Minister Theresa May, used special equipment to spy with, according to the website of Ukraine's security services. You cannot get any closer to the center of power in Canada than standing right beside the Prime Minister's desk. And that is where Stanislav Yezov was just a few weeks ago. And this is where he was last night, being taken away by agents of Ukraine's state security service. He's being accused of treason, spying for Vladimir Putin's Russia. A statement by the security service accused Yezov of collecting data on the activities of governmental institutions by means of special equipment and passing along information to his Russian contacts through electronic communication channels. Perhaps most importantly, it suggests he had been under suspicion for a while. And that leads us back to Canada. So I will just interpret your question sentence by sentence. Yezov was there when the Ukrainian Prime Minister sat down with CBC News during his Ottawa visit, where we asked him what was said with Justin Trudeau. Ukraine needs defensive weapons, high-tech defensive weapons. That is key. The Ottawa trip happened three weeks before the Liberal cabinet approved Canadian companies selling weapons to Ukraine, a significant move on the world stage. So, was the Ukrainian delegation given a heads up? And if so, did that get passed on to Moscow? So for him to be located by the Prime Minister's desk is, is rather strange, I would say, at a minimum. This intelligence expert was startled to see Yezov unattended directly beside Justin Trudeau's desk and away from the leaders. I would say that they sh if it's not a, a security lapse, they should be re revisiting the protocols that they function under when it comes to visiting delegations. We don't want the Russians to be privy to what we you know, may, may have promised or not promised the Ukrainians. So I would, I would hope that when this, this footage is being shown, they would say, oh, uh, that shouldn't have happened. The Prime Minister's office offered little comment other than confirming Yezov was part of the recent Ukrainian delegation. So the big question tonight, what vital information did Stanislav Yezov overhear as he tagged along with the Ukrainian prime minister? There was alarm in Britain today that the accused Russian spy had penetrated 10 Downing Street. He was there when Groysman met with Prime Minister Theresa May to discuss military aid for Ukraine and how to counter Russian cyber attacks. We know Yezkov was there when Groysman met U.S. Vice President Joe Biden at the White House. He may have also been present when Groysman met Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu or German Chancellor Angela Merkel or the head of the European Union. 